Hello, our friends. Today, Alan has some stuff from Jade Q, and we find out who the winner of the July giveaway is. I have something from the mail. Something from the and mail. And a toy. <laughs> but first... What's up, everybody? Like he said, we got the giveaway winner for July. We forgot to do it last weekend. I was late posting. You know, it was just a not a good first week of August. But you know what? The July winner, we will pick it. I've already picked the video. It is going to be the Hucklebuck number 30. Um, I got it all set up. We will be picking this winner right before we leave. So you get X-Men 2099, Doom, Ravage, uh, Punisher, and Spider-Man 2099. So, this is a really good copy, too. So, got these all at my local, awesome local comic shop, ABX Comics and Games. If you're ever in Augusta and you need some comics or games or tabletop games, anything game-related, go in, check them out, and they will hook you up. Paul and Matt are great guys. Let them know that the Vikings sent you. Sorry, it's been a day, folks. Been a day. Been a day. Yeah. All right. Anyway, uh, no, Alan, I'm going to go first. You're going to go first because okay. well, because you got the wonderful 2099 giveaway. That's true. So we'll That's do that true. at the end. So we'll just go right seamlessly from Jade Q to giving stuff there away. We go. All right, that works. What you got? Well, bro? let's show off my toy first. Oh, toys, guys! I got a blue beetle. Gold label, McFarlane. I don't do a lot of McFarlane toys, and it's not because I hate DC or sports or Spawn, really, even. I don't hate Spawn. Um, I just haven't – this isn't a hole I've fallen into, but I think I might have now fallen into it. I, I like this Blue Beetle. Um, I didn't know there was a two-pack I could have gotten with him and Booster Gold. So now I need to try to figure out what my next step is because I don't want to buy the Blue Beetle twice, but I want Booster Gold. And then you may have remembered this book from when I dropped it on my foot. <laughs> I said, you know, I'm going to have Bill Morrison do something in this. So I left this book with Bill Morrison in Heroes Con, and he did something in it. Oh, that's so What a lovely cool. gift from Bill. This is Zombie Homer, and it says four backer. <laughs> that guy is right. wonderful. Bill is a great guy. F friend of the channel. Friend, friend of, the of the channel. channel. Yes. Such a great but, guy and uh, such a great artist. I really wish that wasn't like where it was because now I just want to display it because I love it so much. But well, you can. Sadly, you can. I. I don't think I'm going to... It just take up a lot of shelf space. Doing it that. would take up a ton of space. Which I have behind me. And today I'm blending in with my surroundings like a ninja. Yeah, it works, you know. It but everybody keeps asking when the stuff on the walls come back soon is the answer. Very soon. I'm waiting for a couple things to come back from the frame shop. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that was an expense. Speaking of expensive things to go down, professional framing, not, not cheap. cheap. But I, I was gonna try to do it myself, and these, these fat fingers are not cutting mat out. I got, I got sausage fingers too. So yeah, I'm, no, no, I was no, gonna no. lose a finger doing exacto blade. Yeah, I know, right? All right, so. Here's what we will do. All right, my turn. So, right? You were done, right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I'm right. done. I'm, I'm I've got some Jade to, stuff. I was pretty sure we were transitioning. All right, so Jade, a uh, uh, huge Venom fan like myself, a uh, huge We Live fan. We got a lot of stuff in common and a huge Clayton Crane fan. And he went Ooh. to Dallas Fan Expo and Clayton Crane was there and he had an exclusive there and I asked him to pick this up for me and he did. And uh, he sent it in this awesome packaging. 
It's really wow. good. Above That's for one book? Above and beyond. I hope it's not just one book. Oh, man. Oh, boy. He put a human body in there. No, he did something and... All right. Did he wrap it all in packing tape? No, no, no. All right, so here's the book that I got from Jade. I love this book. Let's see it. Ooh. Batman 134, oil painted version variant by Clayton Crane, limited to 600. Turn your uh, mylar there a bit. You're catching your entire screen. Am I? Oh, yeah, goes. there you go. That's All perfect. Right, there we go. This thing is sexy. And it's got, of course, his signature right down there. So I'm going to hold on. Because I'm going to meet Clay Run Day. And I'm going to get this. I want to get this signed. Get it and, signed. Yeah. yeah. But uh, and this this thing, I love Clayton. I love his art, man. His art is so great. I'm so glad he's not just doing Venom now. I mean, he does a great job on Venom. Don't get me wrong. But I'm glad he's not doing just Venom. You know what I mean? He just he needs he's just too good of an artist. All right, so he said that he was gonna throw an extra thing in or two in there because it took he took a while to ship. He has other he's got a lot of stuff going on. So I was like, no worries, man. He didn't have to do that. Jade, well, I broke him down. You don't have to worry about that. Um. So this is now I found out why he sent this in there. All right, so one on top. Oh, this is cool. This is just a cover by Scotty Young. Oh, that is cool. We're also I Scotty like Young fans. I'm I'm coming along on the Scotty Young train. One of the artists I like following. That's a good cover. That is so awesome. That is so cool. Yeah, it's not even a book. It's just a backboard or some of some type of sort, or I don't know. Oh, that's awesome. So we got that. And then Oh man, this dude. All right. We have Venom number three from the uh, Rom V story, signed and sketched by Clayton Crane in a 9 L. Holy hell. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Wait, signed and sketched. So Clayton did a revision? A remo Um, I don't know. Or are they calling the murder sig there? I I'm thinking it is because there's a some blood on the skull. Yeah, that's the murder sig. Yeah. So wow. I uh, whether it's a sketch, oh, I don't yeah. care. That this is Jade. I love you, man. Wow. Damn, Freaking Jade. Wow. Knocked it out of the park, you did. Holy crap. This is amazing. This is just such a cool cover, too. And the murder sig was perfect for this. Wow. Yeah, it's a badass cover. Oh, man. Wow, that is just... Yep, we're getting... This is going up on the wall. Oh, speaking of which, a little update for everybody. Um, the wall is going to be coming soon, and the video, the tour of the entire house, because uh, my beautiful fiance has let me decorate throughout the house, not just in our shared room here. So I have some art in places. Wait, um, that's a shared room? So that's not your Marilyn Monroe inspiration? No, unfortunately, that's her Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> So see, um, I thought that to me that screamed to Alan. I know, right? Um, but you know what's cool? Um, and you, you will see it when you when I do the tour, is that she has a Mar Marilyn Monroe pop figure that has that exact scene on it. Oh so, yeah, so that's pretty cool. She usually collects stitch, but there's a few few pops here and there that she likes as well that I pick up for. Her. Still looking for two stitches that she really wants, but Speaking uh, of stitches, will we see your cross stitch collection? My cross stitch? No, I don't have a cross stitch collection. If for those of you who don't know, Alan secretly cross stitches. In fact, he makes these beautiful bless this mess uh, little things people frame in their houses. He sells them at farmers markets. <laughs> <laughs> we 
needed that. After today, we needed that, man. We did. We, we did. needed that. All right. So let's. Uh, I will always make myself feel better by making fun right. of Alan. Let's go ahead and. Uh, yeah, let's give away some of your books. Give away some of my books. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh, boy. All right. You got the picker up? Can you see? I see it. All right. We already have the video link up, which is uh, the Huckleberry which one? number 30 from two weeks ago. And uh, we pulled the comments, which were 11. And so here we go. Ooh. Evil's Comics. For the yes. Win. Good guy. Good guy. It's not going to be Jean Malo. I want it to be Evil's Comics. Yeah. That'll be my new rule. Uh, or Dirty. Or, you know what? Honestly, all those guys, Larry, all of the, the regulars in there. Yeah. You just hate to see somebody swoop in and grab it off of one. I know, right? So, Evil's Comics, um, hit me up on IG. I'll get your address, and I'll get this shipped out to you. I talk to him fairly regularly. Yeah, this, too, nice five book, uh, this five book little thing here. Um, I actually, I mean, and I'll be honest, people, I got these at ABX, and I saw them, and I was like, man, every every one of these, these four, the X-Men 29.9 is about the same type of copy I have. Um, but these four were better than the ones I have in my PC, and I was going to just upgrade them. I was like, you know what? No, just give them away. And, and those are all cool. original, not reprints. No, these are all original. All original. That's awesome. Yep. All good original. for Mike. Mike's a good dude. Or uh, evil, or if you'd correct. rather. This one is a newsy. Not that that matters, but I just yes. noticed that. So. Damn it, Alan. I'm going to break you that habit, too. What's that? The newsstand BS. We don't talk one. about that in this house. I have another sexy newsie. It's right there. Yeah, yeah. And did I care that it was a newsie? Never. No, you didn't. But it's cool. No. Hey, I enjoy it. At least that got to the point where newsstands were actually not the majority anymore. Yeah. So, the comic book shops were firmly in control of the market. I am way. actually thinking of sending that off here in a little bit to CDCS. Oh, get it. Thinking. Signature verified. Okay, so I've heard a rumor uh -oh. that uh, Rob Liefeld does not allow them to do his SIG. So you might want to reach out to them and see. Ooh. So certain people will okay. say, I don't want to be a part of your signature verification. Oh, I heard a rumor God. about that, and it's not from Rob himself. So All right, well, I'll have to hit him up that. and see before I actually send it out there because I don't want to send it and then get a different color. I would, I would imagine it says something on the website because you have to tell them who it is when you send yeah. it in. All right, well. So hopefully they would be up front with that, but yeah, this thing I would just still Jade Crick, really, dude, really. Wow. Who knew Jade was this nice? The way he goes after Burke. <laughs> all of the behind all of those mean Burke comments <laughs> lays a heart of gold. Like most of us, though, who isn't mean to Burke? Burke yeah. gets bullied. <laughs> Wow. All right, guys. So until next time, we'll see you later. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy. And uh, let us know what you thought of all the books we picked up. Evil's Comics, please hit me up so you can collect this stuff. Next oh, week, he will. Next week, we will announce what we're giving away for the month of August. All right. So just stay tuned. And remember, comments get you into the drawing. Thank you, everybody. So comment. Give us your comments.